beautiful essences. It's Lindsay Essence with, from Everlasting Essence. And I'm exhausted. The reason why I'm making a video for you guys today <clears throat> is I wanted to talk about something that's kind of near and dear to my heart, which is cleaning. You know, it was <clears throat> something that's been brought to my attention recently is that, you know, as <clears throat> pagans, you know, we live a very normal life that, just like everybody else, we have jobs, we go to work, we go to school, we are parents, we do everything just like everybody else. <clears throat> and today, I did some magical cleaning and I wanted to talk to you about it. <clears throat> I say magical, but it's more like intental, intent cleaning. You know, I take something as mundane and simple as sweeping and doing dishes and mopping and turn it into a spiritual experience. And that's why I wanted to talk to you guys about <clears throat> is, you know, there's so many different people that are like, well, I don't understand pagans and blah, 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 and I don't really quite, uh, I don't get what you're saying. <clears throat> Sorry for me going, <clears throat> it's just all the dust and everything from today. It's just, whew. Anyways, the point of, of it is, is I want to convey to you what it is like for me to clean you know it's like the shedding of um it's the same as like taking a shower shedding of of the skin cells and you know what I see we'll take it we'll take it real simple you guys home is sacred sacred space you know it's it's a place you come to break bread it's a place you come to sleep it's a place that you come to relax it's a place that you can do work in it's a place where you raise your children it's a place where you are a family. Millions of different things. And so the whole entire process of cleansing and cleaning and maintaining is important. Um, not just for your house, but on a spiritual level. You know, spiritual maintenance. And finding activities and all of... Finding all of the activities in my life to be a spiritual experience. Turn it into a spiritual type thing. So... <clears throat> As I'm vacuuming, as I'm sweeping, as I'm mopping, I am thinking about the debris and everything that is going in my life um, as part of a cleanse. You know, it's a spiritual cleanse. And that's the intent. That is what I'm thinking about as I'm doing this. You know, it's... For me, I try to live a very spiritual life in all of my affairs today, in, all, in every aspect of my life. And so just doing something as simple as cleaning and washing the water go down the drain from the mop bucket or from, <clears throat> sometimes I pour it outside, honestly, put it back into Mother Earth. I think I did one to Mother Earth and one down the drain because I messed up the, the cleaning, whatever. And then, um, you know, washing the dishes, seeing all the suds every day, you know, just the cleansing, cleaning, having a clean slate. You know, that's what I'm thinking about. So, I just wanted to post a quick video for you guys of just <clears throat> basically how you can have a spiritual experience in, in everyday life. And how you can turn something as mundane as cleaning into a spiritual act. So, yeah. If you like this video, like it, thumbs up, subscribe below so you don't ever miss a video. Comments, if you have comments and questions and whatnot or video suggestions or anything and you guys have a blessed day namaste